Hello Stampers! My name is Linda Bedinger and I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator. And today I have a little different video. I have an unboxing video. I just got my box from Stampin' Up! that's got my pre-pre-pre-order uh, that we were able to make uh, while we were there at uh, on stage. And so I thought I would share it with you. And I just have pulled everything out of the box and I'm going to try and pull it together here as we talk through it. So let's just get started. Okay, so here is the first of the sets. This is called the Tropical Oasis Suite. And it is made up of these beautiful papers. I'm going to pull these out so we can look at them. And um, isn't that gorgeous? These are hibiscus, and I don't know what the little flower is, but it's lovely. And then it has this green pattern on the back. And it's just um, almost like a texture pattern on that one. Then there is this paper, which is a an old-fashioned like station wagon. And on the back of this paper is kind of a, a brown texture weave uh, pattern. So I'm going to put that down like this. And the paper, of course, is absolutely gorgeous. Then the next one is this beautiful kind of a peachy colored um, lily. And it looks like a, um, I don't know what kind of lily, maybe not quite a tiger lily, but it's got speckles on it. And I'll, I'll bring it up so you can see it a little closer. It's really pretty. And then it's got those same little white flowers uh, around it and some those very uh, big palm leaf kinds of things. And this has got kind of a blue pattern um, on the back side of it. Gosh, that's gorgeous. Very, very pretty. Then there's this large leaf pattern here. And then on the back side of it is, it looks like pink flamingos and leaves in light and dark colors. So there's that one. Then there's this one. It has yellow pineapples on the back side of the paper. And the front side of the paper is all kinds of tropical fruits. I see a, I think that's passion fruit, uh, guava, bananas, pineapples, and little, little flowers in between. I see some peaches, it looks like. Very pretty, very colorful. And uh, let's see, on the back side, oh, that is the yellow on the back side of that. Then the final one in this piece is this um, bird of paradise flower. Isn't that gorgeous? And on the back side of it is um, palm trees in greens. So there you have it. That is the whole um, paper assortment for this Tropical Oasis Suite. Now, let me show you, uh, let's see, the coordinating colors with this. There's a million of them. It's just about everything. Daffodil Delight Early Espresso, Grapefruit Grove, Mango, Mint Macaron, Olive Oil, uh, Old Olive, Pear Pizzazz, Pool Party, Real red, soft sea foam, soft suede, but it looks like you could probably get away on some of these with some of the pretty peacock and others in here. It's just gorgeous. They're beautiful. Anyway, so that is the paper. Then this is the stamp set, which I got at on stage, Timeless Tropical, and it's got this big, beautiful hibiscus flower, some palm trees, the pineapple leaf, little flower here and birthday, friendship, uh, rest and relax, thank you, and a hello. Then these are the dies that go with this. And 
there this cuts out this large flower I'm sure this one cuts out this flower there's some a little small sprig of leaf this leaf this leaf another giant leaf with some of these pattern papers in here that would be very pretty um, this is the top of the pineapple three little flowers aloha and a little feather so that is the die set that goes with this and the other thing that kind of that goes with this suite is this little set of trinkets and they are so cute there is a a couple of well here let me just see if i can't get them all here on my hand so i can bring it up there is a ukulele and a pineapple and a hibiscus flower let's see it looks like those are the main shapes four different shapes and this is 24 so there's probably six of each of these little embellishments in here aren't those just the sweetest things so very very cute and that is one of the pieces that goes with this suite and the other one is this and i'm just going to see if i can free up and end it is called tropical no braided burlap trim and so it is definitely braided which means it can be unbraided frayed on the edges and in a burlap trim that's a little bit thinner than our other burlap ribbon. And it's very heavy, uh, thick, very attractive. Those are the elements that go with this. Now there's also an embossing folder, but I didn't get that for some reason. I don't know why. Um, but that is what I got for the Tropical Oasis Suite. All right, I'm going to move this out of the way now and move on to the next one I have is this Parisian. This one is called the Parisian Blossoms Suite. Isn't that gorgeous? And so there's this paper, and I wasn't sure about this looking in the catalog, but it's beautiful in person. It's foiled in silver, and here is the front and then the back of this top, kind of a peachy pink. So there is that one, and it's got blossoms and, and little uh, flourishes there. Then there is this one, which are blocks and keys. And the back side of that one is fleur de lis in this uh, petal pink color. And look at this. This is gorgeous. It's kind of um, a floral and it says Parisian sweet blossoms. So there's these beautiful flowers and on the back side is this just a little pattern and then there's this floral piece with a lot of um, flowers and leaves overlaid in silver on that one and then small pink flowers and that's got that pattern on the back so let me pull this out so large and small of these uh, flowers then this one is oh like little traveling suitcases here and circles looks like it might be a stamp for a uh, passport and little eiffel towers and circles here and so there's that pattern pretty and soft this is gorgeous this is um, a script and it's just words in french <laughs> and the words are silvered so very pretty and on the back side of that one is this pretty little uh, pool party uh, floral image. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I can just see so many of these combinations coming together here. Oh my gosh, it's just gorgeous. Let's see, the stamp set on that one. This, 
Forever Blossoms stamp set, which I got at OnStage. Isn't that beautiful? And so there's these beautiful flowers that we see in this pattern, this pattern, and um, this pattern. And then these are the kind of flowers, they look like, almost like cherry blossoms, that are in this one with the, with the uh, tower. And then there is a um, die set, Parisian dies here. Let me pull that one out. Here is the die set, and there it is. It's got this pretty flourish. It says Merci on it, Amour on this side. It's got a fleur de lis, um, and it's got this outline of the Eiffel Tower and a detailed piece of the Eiffel Tower. And let's see, there's also another stamp and die set that goes with it. There is a stamp set with the Eiffel Tower. Stamp set that goes with the Eiffel Tower. And then there is another die set that goes with the floral piece. And it's called Cherry Blossoms. So it was Cherry Blossoms. Let me see if I can find that. So this is one of those mega sweets. So here is the stamp set. And there's the fleur de lis that gets cut out. And then this would be cut out with a circle punch. And um, let's see, this one has more of the script on it. Follow your heart will take you incredible places. Life is a magnificent adventure. You're the joy of my life, amour. And then this could be, be set up like a um, stamp. And let's see, this one is the die set that goes with this stamp set here. Yeah, this is one of those big monster mega sweets with two dies, two die sets and two stamp sets plus the paper. Oh, a couple of embellishments which I can show you because I have some of them. This is the die set that goes with the flowers. Isn't that pretty? So this die here must cut out this, yeah, this piece here. There's a die that cuts out this. There's two dies that cut this out, two that cut that out, some other leaves, four, a little bit larger, a little bit smaller, some stamens, two, some little individual flowers like this. This is included in the cutouts, and then some other flowers here that you might be able to just put up on top of here. I'll have to mess with that and see what it does, but isn't that gorgeous? So that is this mega suite, and it also includes this, which is some of the um, metallic edged ribbon. Isn't that pretty? And it's thin, it's small, and I know this stuff ties beautifully. So there we go with the silver edge, metallic edged, petal pink, and then it's called Metallic Edge Ribbon in the Petal Pink. Oh, it's gorgeous. And the other thing that's included in this, this is part of it too. This is um, Champagne Rhinestones Basic Jewels. Isn't that pretty? Finally, some goldy colored um, rhinestones. And this is the embossing folder, Parisian, Parisian Flourish embossing folder. Isn't that pretty? And I don't know if we'll be able to see the detail in the actual embossing folder, but let's see if we can do that. I put this on some paper. I think you can see the size of that detail. It's very, very pretty. There's the front side of it absolutely gorgeous. So this is the mega suite on Parisian Blossoms suite is what it's called. So let me move this out of the way and we can move on to um, the next suite. Let's move on to the theme of the 
catalog, which is this lovely poppy pattern, Peaceful Poppies. This is another of the mega sweets. So let's start with the paper. Here is the paper for this beautiful poppy sweet. There is this, aren't those sweet, poppies and greeneries with blue behind it. Oh my gosh, look at that. And then what look like watercolor poppies. I'm going to have a hard time deciding which side of the paper I want to use on that one. Then there's purple poppies here and greenery and white and a pretty green stripe. Then small poppies. Look at that, isn't that just gorgeous? And on the back side of it is kind of an orange color wash. Then more poppies with both the red, yellow, and purple in them. Isn't that fun? And then on the back side of it is purple. That would go well with that one. And a color wash with white polka dots, then even smaller poppies. <laughs> so we've got monster ones, different kinds of what look like uh, watercolor ones and more realistic ones, and then just lots of poppies. And on the back side of that one is this pretty blue color wash with a pale stripe. Very pretty. Then this one, this is interesting. This is, um, it looks like it's built so that you could cut this in half and get card fronts as a background with the purple and the, and the orange poppies. And it's got these speckles on it. And the back side of that one is a pretty, oh, isn't that gorgeous, green um, color wash. The next one in this is the Painted Poppies Stamp Set. There is the Painted Poppies Stamp Set, and that one comes with painted labels dies. Labels dies. And here are my painted labels dies. And this one is kind of fun because it really is mostly labels, and the other die set with the other stamp set really has the poppy cutouts in it. So this is another of the mega sweets, but here are the poppy, what are they called again? Painted label dies. Doesn't this remind you of Swirly Bird? But what I understand is this cuts out and leaves the label in so you can stamp in the center of it and then it has this swirly stuff around the outside. And there are a couple, this one cuts out this poppy, this one cuts out this, this cuts out the leaf, there's two of those. Then there's another die and this cute little trim. Isn't that pretty? And then this has a cluster of uh, poppies, a little bit like this paper, and then a splatter. Very, very pretty. Okay, so let me bring up the other two. Peaceful Moments stamp set. And let's see. There it is. Peaceful Moments stamp set. And this is all sayings. So life is better with a friend like you. Always remember, happy birthday. You shouldn't have, but I'm glad you did. Congratulations. With deepest sympathy, thank you. Wishing you every happiness this special day will bring. These are moments we'll look back on with joy. Thinking of you with all my heart and congratulations. So that is the second stamp set that goes with this. And then the Poppy Moments dies. And that's this die set. It looks to be quite a large one. And it has all kinds of cutouts for the poppies. Here we go with this one. Oh my gosh, those are gorgeous. All right, so 
we have big poppy die, smaller poppy die, and I think that cuts these out as well. But it's both the, the flower or a piece and then the outline. And I want to take you back to the cover of this catalog. You can see where you would cut out the center piece here and then these outline pieces on the outside of the poppies to create some individual poppy elements. Very, very cute. All right, there's a couple of different stamens, lots of different kinds of leaves, um, and more leaves, and some petals, I guess. I don't know, we'll have to cut these out just to see what they are. And this looks like a cluster of poppies. This is a piece that comes with it, and I've not opened this yet either. And this is an, um, an embellishment kit that comes with this suite. And so here are some die cut pieces. They look to be quite sturdy. Um, yeah, they're, they're die cuts, but it's very thick, very heavy duty. Isn't that pretty? So we've got some little poppies, some little clusters, and some individual double poppy clusters there. And then we've got some black elements. Aren't those pretty to go behind? They're done on a matte black, and then they're foiled in black. So that's gorgeous. And then look at these. Oh my goodness. These are all a um, couple of pages of poppies in the uh, vellum. And I'm going to, oh, it shows perfectly on this black. <laughs> so I'm going to put that on and bring it up so you can see. So smaller poppies, full poppies, side poppies, these poppies with a little bud. These two things, it's its very much like this first page of Elements, only more of them on this. And there's a couple pages of that. And then there is a couple pages of this, which looks to be that same set of material, but it's on like watercolor paper and it's embossed in white. So emboss resist, and one could color or use the sprinkles on this. Oh my gosh, is that going to be fun. So this is an elements packet that comes with the Poppy Mega Suite. Then there is this, which is something new again. And this is Whisper White Crinkled Seam Binding, but it's narrower than like our crushed curry one. And isn't that fun? So that comes with this suite as well. And then there's one more thing that comes with this. There's a poppy sequin mix. Peaceful poppy sequins. And there's translucent oranges and reds and purples. There's gold, clear, and there's a bunch of them in here. This is 750 sequins. <laughs> so I don't think we're going to run out of sequins. And there's gold sequins in here. Isn't that fun? So there's that also as a part of it. So that is this total suite. Uh, Peaceful Poppies. Again, a mega suite with two different stamp sets, two different die sets, the paper, this beautiful elements kit, um, dies for both, um, and um, these poppies. So that is the next thing I got. The next one I want us to look at is the From My Heart Suite, and it is all about Valentine's. <laughs> 
and hearts. I guess Valentine's don't always have to be hearts. From my heart specialty designer series paper. And it's Flirty Flamingo Real Red and Whisper White. So here are the papers. You see those beautiful little hearts. And I think there's with this comes two punches. And I am almost positive that these punches, sorry about the crinkling, should have opened these ahead of time, but I'm almost positive that this heart, this punch will cut out the heart on this paper. Let's just see what happens. Absolutely perfectly with okay, the Okay, sorry, I had a little interruption there. And I was just showing you the paper and the punches. And this punch with the scalloped edge is meant to cut out these hearts. Now, um, the paper is just gorgeous. There's these little hearts in a grid on the back side of the foiled hearts. Then these white foiled hearts. And on the back side of it are little hearts that look like they're growing on the top of a stem of, um, almost looks like a leaf, but I realized looking at it, it's, they're arrows, arrows pointing at the little heart. Then there's this foiled paper. Isn't that pretty? With the flirty flamingo dots and the white. And then this paper with a riot of hearts. Then there's this stripe, tiny stripe paper. I'm trying to keep these all in the camera shot here. <laughs> and um, then this paper is, let's see, it looks to be the same. Oh, I see. This one has a pink background and this one has a white background. Then there is this paper, which is again, little foiled hearts. And the back side of that one is little arrows. And then there's this one that's got a stripe. And this one that has tiny little red hearts, a diagonal stripe and tiny red hearts. Anyway, that is the paper combination for this suite, and it is called From My Heart Suite. Now, and so here are the punches. Close those up, and we can just have them sitting here, and you can see that there are the punches, and the bundle is these two punches, and then this, which is the heart felt, um, photopolymer stamp set. And here is a little, looks like lace, uh, and the inside of the lace is hearts, and a couple of other little slim hearts, and my guess is that these punches punch out various ones of these. Roses are red, violets are blue, from my heart to yours, love you lots, being friends is better than eating candy, but let's do that too. <laughs> so lucky to have a friend like you and happy Valentine's Day. So that's this stamp set. Then along with this comes, this is new and they're called From My Heart Faceted Gems, but they're not on a card. Oh, look at that. They are little gems that are truly faceted and they're kind of tall um, and they're in different sizes in pink in flirty in white and they're faceted and there are looks like 180 in here all different sizes for each of the colors, including little tiny ones. So that's part of this, and these are called From My Heart Faceted Gems. Then these, and they're just so sweet, I'm gonna open this package up again, I apologize for the crinkling here. These are 
little heart doilies and they come in flirty and in real red I don't know what that little oh I see it just got folded over so there's uh, doilies with uh, some detail on them and that's as, about as big as my palm so it's a pretty good sized little little doily and so there's a package of those and that has 40 so 20 of each color doily hearts then there is real red double stitched satin ribbon see what this looks like oh my gosh isn't that gorgeous and you can see the double rows of stitching one on either end and that is soft and pliable and I'm sure is going to just tie and make bows beautifully. Yeah, it is. Isn't that pretty? So there is the double stitched satin red ribbon. Part of this suite is this heart foil tins. And let's take a look at these. So these would be for maybe some Valentine's treats. Oh, these are big. Look at this. Oh my goodness. So there are tins in here. Three, six, ten tins in red and silver. And then these must be the lids. So, boy, those are those are pretty darn substantial. And so the way this works is there is your tin and there is your lid. So this is quite a substantial um, sized piece and uh, for Valentine's treats and things like that and I bet one of these little doilies would fit cutely right on the top of this. Um, and um, so that's surprising to me. Those are quite large. Look at that. <laughs> so this is uh, the, let's see, what are they called again? These are the heart foil tins. And there's 10 to a package. This is all the pieces that are in the from my heart sweet. Oh, there's also a set of dies, it looks like. This is called Detail Heart Dies. Let's just open it and see, since we're working with hearts here. Oh, this one. This one is a... Um, does a whole card front and let's see there's a stamp set to go with that okay so these two pieces go together I did get the stamp set and the die set this one is called heart to heart and comes as a bundle and this one has little flowers and leaves and some sentiments here it's got a beautiful happy Valentine's Day and then this heart die cuts out like a page front of hearts that would go on the front of this. And that is one of the bundles in the catalog. This one I showed for, but I didn't have punch that went with the timeless tulip. But here is the, the punch that goes with the timeless tulips stamp set. And I think if you saw my swap, we had made a card using these two elements. So I was given this at on stage, and then this completed the bundle for me. This one, which is interesting, called Mountain Air, a photopolymer. And look at how long these stamps are. And I'm gonna see if I can bring this up underneath where you can see the detail. Yeah, I, I can. I'll bring this up. Look at the detail in those mountains. So they've got little ridges all through them. And that's a cloud, set of clouds. This is a textured globe. 
like. I'll bring this up so you can see this. This will give you an idea. And a couple of individual pines and a double pine, some birds, some clouds. And this looks to be like the um, uh, planet that you could see up there, like the moon when you could see all the detail. Then this monster long mountain range. And then this, which is a bunch of pines in the back and then water towards the front. But look at the size of those stamps. My word, you can go completely across your card easily. Then there is a die set to go with this um, stamp set. And I'm looking at these for the first time with you. So this is the uh, die set that goes with this stamp, Mountain Air. And it cuts out a representation of the mountains, of the tops of the trees. So these are edge to edge. That one is edge to edge. A couple of tall pines and a representation of this. So there's the solid one and, the, and then the detailed one in all of these. Oh, I know what this is. Okay, so... These are reversible stamps. You can stamp with the detail on one side or you can just stamp the image by putting it on your block the other way. So these three little birds, when you stamp it on the back side, makes this small group of clouds. There we go. And this has the detail of the earth or the moon or whatever but the other side is just the big round image. So this is uh, an experiment with the items being reversible. And so you get solid images along with detailed images and the dies to go with most of it. So that is this, and it's again called Mountain Air Bundle. So that's gonna be fun to play with, something completely new and different. These are just some of the others that I was able to get. This one is called a happy birthday to you. Isn't that pretty with the flowers on the cake? Happy birthday, some platters to you and celebrate. Very simple. This one is one of the freebies, sale abrasion. And this is lovely lily pad. And this is some water lilies and the pads that they sit on. And again, I think this might be one, yes it is, where the stamps are reversible. So you get the stamp this way, or if you stamp it the other way, you get this image. So you can get the water, you can get all of these. So it's like getting, it's eight stamps, but it's like getting 16 because you can stamp it either way. And then with this one also came, is one of the freebies that's available in celebration is the die set that goes with the lilies, water lilies. So let's take this out and take a look at it. And there they are. It cuts out the detailed lily pad, the large lily, the small, or a large and a small, and some leaves, and a bud, and then this would cut out the whole image, and then this trim die, not sure exactly what that is or how it cuts out, but it'll be interesting to find out. <laughs> anyway, so that is one of the pieces from Sale Abration. This cake one is also from Sale Abration. So let's see what else I have here. This one, which is officially the cutest thing I have seen in forever. It's called the Gangs All Mirror, and these are meerkats. This is a Sale Abration, so this is a free one. And there's meerkats here from all of us. A meerkat out of his out of his underground there. We're here for you. Little hats, a little 
I guess that's a frog. Uh, single meerkat. Happy birthday to a stand-up friend. Isn't that cute? And this little cactus. So that is sell, Sale Abration stamp sets. Is another one. It is Sale Abration. It is sending you thoughts. So it's all uh, sentiments. Happy birthday, another sensational year of you. Congratulations, thanks, sending a little something. If loving thoughts could heal, you'd be better off already. And it says, what's this I hear? Well, all I can say is, happy birthday, congratulations, thanks, so on and so forth. With a big wish for happiness. Isn't that nice? So that is another sale abrasion. And then this one, I think, is the last thing. And this one is a sale abrasion. I think this is the first time they've done this. Sale abrasion host stamp and it's called the little ladybug and there's says hey lady you're so sweet thinking of you you're cute as a bug spread your wings and fly happy birthday thank you and little ladybugs in different positions uh here and one that's holding a little flower isn't that the cutest thing all right so that is it it's quite a haul uh, fortunately for me, uh, I had earned some of these things and then some of them I purchased and some of them I was given. And so going to convention is really, really worthwhile because you get so many free things. There were two other ones that were free that I showed from before, which is My Meadow which is a stamp set with no greetings, and then this beautiful, breathtaking bouquet one. So it really is quite a haul between what you get at convention, plus you have the chance to pre-order some things. If you're a demonstrator, you have a chance to earn some lots of free things, both through Stampin' Rewards and through something called Flex Points that you can carry over to the new year that you can use to buy things with. And so I have, as the result of all of that, quite a haul. This is a, the breadth of the material that I brought back in my unboxing because I got my box. So that's it for me today. Just wanted to come on and share some of these beautiful things. And we'll get back to making uh, more cards, more Christmas cards and more regular cards and more tips in the, in the future video. It's still November, and so you can get in on my drawing. And my drawing is the Christmas Time is Here, the Rose Bundle, Christmas Rose, and the dies, and then the one package of paper. And so uh, all you need to do to get yourself in my drawing is to put an order of any size on my website, albedinger.stampinup.net, or you can get to it through my blog, www.inkandingenuity.com. So uh, again, that's it for me. Thank you so much for stopping by my YouTube channel today. I do so appreciate it. And if you don't already have a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, I'd love to be your demonstrator. Or you could join my team. Um, and uh, so I'll be back soon, like I said, with more cards, more tips, and more projects. Bye! Bye!